So the Insta360 X3, honestly, out of all the cameras that I take with me to different places, this is the one that gets the most attention, either when I'm posting it on my social media or just when I just take it out and start recording, people around me are always asking me about it. And it even got better with this newest update and let me tell you all about it. I'm actually using the Insta360 camera right now to film this, so yeah. Mr. Black. By the way, welcome to the channel. My name is Danny Black. I love to share with you cool gear that comes my way and also some tips and tricks and updates and things like that. So if you're new here, don't be a stranger. Click that button. I also put links to everything down in the description. So you can find it down there if you're feeling like picking up an X3. Check it out down there. It's a great camera and I highly recommend it. Also, I'll throw a surprise link down there too. So if you're looking for something random, check it out down there. And if you have an X3 right now and you're just wondering how do you upgrade your firmware, it's super simple. Connect it to the app on your phone and it will give you a prompt and it will update it and do all the stuff for you. And one of their biggest updates is they've added a lot more to their Pure Shot. So right now you can get 72 megapixels of Pure Shot. So this is what it would look like before taking a picture. It's not as good in the low light, but because of Pure Shot and the AI, it really makes it a lot more crisp and a lot less noise in the darker spots. And that's really fun to do if you have like a family photo, instead of having to get your phone out and everyone kind of gather in, you just pull this thing out, take that shot, and you can get some really creative little photos with your family on the vacations and stuff like that. I, I just love that feature. Another really cool feature that they added is webcam mode. And what that does is that you can connect this thing right to your computer and you can use this as a webcam. And you can shuffle through and pick one lens or the other, or both lenses, yeah, you can have a split screen and if someone's on one end and you're on the other end, you can have both pictures showing at the same time. It splits the screen for you. That way if you're in Zoom or you're on a live streaming app, you can just use both lenses and have the cameras displayed that way. But lastly, I wanna share the new feature where it's like a handover to your computer. So right now you can easily take this footage and you can use the app and you can edit it pretty easily. You can move your phone around and just control the different points and zoom in and all that stuff. It's really easy to do. But if you wanna take it a step further, you can also dump the files onto your computer. And through this little handover part, it kind of records what you've already made on your phone. And then you can go onto your computer and fine tune it that much more. And that's a really cool aspect. To so someone like me, I love editing the files. And with the phone, it's just so much easier to get a smoother shot, especially if you're just kind of turning the phone by itself. But when you go into the computer, it's nice to see that it's already laid out for you and you can just fine tune it that little bit more. So those are some big updates to this X3, just making it that much better of a 360 camera. I mean, it was already an amazing camera before that, but that's one of the things I love about Insta360 is that they bring out those firmware updates just to make it better and better for your experiences. But that's it for today's video. I just wanted to keep you updated on these new features and a lot more coming up to the channel. A lot of really cool products to share with you. I can't wait and a lot of fun adventures as well. So stay tuned and I'll see you next time. Mr. Black.